Japan has introduced real humanoid robots that are changing how people live and work. These robots look and act like humans, and they use smart technology to improve everyday life and human connections. Japan has a long history with humanoid robots that dates back over 50 years. It began in 1973 with the Wabot-1, often recognized as the first full-scale humanoid robot. This impressive machine could walk, grasp items, and perform simple tasks. At that time, this technology seemed almost magical, a glimpse into a future where machines could mimic human movement and understanding. Fast forward to 2000, and we met Honda's ASIMO, a revolutionary creation that truly fascinated the world. ASIMO could run, dance, and engage with people gracefully, highlighting Japan's remarkable talent in robotic design. However, Beyond the technical milestones, these advancements reflected a deeper belief in Japan that robots should improve human life instead of replacing it. We're doing a giveaway for a $200 Amazon gift card when we hit 1,000 subscribers. Make sure to smash that subscribe button and comment below so we know to add you into the raffle. Thanks, and best of luck to everyone who enters. Over the years, this belief has shaped Japan's approach to robot development not as cold, mechanical devices, but as intelligent and emotional partners. While early models focused on mobility and dexterity, today's humanoid robots are built to think, learn, and even feel. They are equipped with advanced AI systems that can understand language, recognize faces, and interpret human emotions. These robots don't merely follow commands, they adjust to their environment. For instance, a humanoid can sense when someone appears upset and respond with compassion, providing comfort. They can also recall previous interactions, making each encounter feel more personal and human-like. Modern Japanese humanoids beautifully blend engineering with a touch of empathy. These remarkable machines are designed to navigate uneven surfaces, weave through cluttered spaces, and perform delicate hand movements that once seemed beyond the reach of technology. Their faces, powered by tiny motors, can smile, blink, and mimic expressions in real time allowing for truly authentic, human-like interactions. This emotional intelligence has turned robots into companions rather than mere assistants, especially in a country facing a rapidly aging population. With Japan's aging society grappling with a significant shortage of caregivers, humanoid robots have stepped up as a hopeful solution. In many elder care facilities, robots like Pepper and Paro, the robotic seal, provide comfort and companionship to seniors. They engage in conversation, play music, and can even sense when someone is feeling lonely. Their calm, gentle presence has been shown to ease anxiety and foster emotional connections among older adults. These robots don't tire, lose patience, or judge. They simply offer care as they were designed to do. It's a new kind of compassion, powered by code and circuits. Beyond caregiving, Japan's humanoids are making waves across various industries. In hospitals, robots assist surgeons with precise movements that help reduce the risk of human error. In the hospitality sector, humanoid receptionists like Junko Chihira greet tourists, provide directions, and answer questions in multiple languages with a warm, lifelike touch. At advanced hotels in Tokyo, robots deliver towels, check in guests, and transport luggage with polite efficiency. While these tasks may seem straightforward, they highlight a larger truth. Humanoid robots are becoming dependable partners in our everyday lives. Their influence stretches far beyond just hospitals and hotels. They're becoming a part of everyday life. In shopping malls and exhibition centers, humanoid robots are stepping up as entertainers and guides. With their natural speech, expressive gestures, and ability to engage with crowds, they make fantastic ambassadors for technology. People are not only impressed by their mechanical precision, but also by the human-like qualities woven into their design. Japan has truly transformed robotics into a blend of art and science, a beautiful mix of heart and hardware. At events like Japan's Expo 2025, the country is gearing up to unveil a whole ecosystem of humanoid robots that work together seamlessly. Some will greet visitors, while others will take on roles as maintenance workers or guides. These showcases aim to demonstrate that robots aren't here to replace humans. Instead, they're meant to coexist in harmony. Beneath this impressive technology lies Japan's cultural philosophy regarding machines. While some societies may view automation as a threat, Japan embraces robots as companions and partners. This perspective is deeply rooted in Shinto beliefs, which suggest that even inanimate objects can possess a spirit. As a result, 
Japanese culture nurtures a sense of empathy toward machines. This balance is clear in Japan's robot shops and showrooms, where realistic humanoids attract curious onlookers. In Tokyo's Akihabara area, crowds come together to watch robots sing, dance, and talk just like people. Families, students, and tourists engage with these machines, breaking down the lines between the natural and the artificial. These public areas aren't merely shopping locations, they're cultural platforms where humans and robots learn to connect. Every smile shared and every wave exchanged brings society a bit closer to accepting this new coexistence. The emergence of humanoid robots also ignites crucial conversations about work, feelings, and ethics. If a machine can offer comfort to a lonely individual or help a surgeon with perfect accuracy, what does that imply for human purpose? Japan addresses this by seeing robots as partners rather than rivals. The goal isn't to replace humans in the job market, but to enhance their capabilities with mechanical allies that increase productivity and creativity. In factories, humanoid robots collaborate with humans, handling repetitive or dangerous tasks while leaving the decision-making to their human co-workers. This collaboration has led to safer, faster, and more efficient workplaces. The economic effects are also noteworthy. Humanoid robots signify a major investment opportunity with Japan leading the global robotics industry. By exporting these technologies, Japan not only strengthens its economy, but also promotes a vision of a more balanced world where machines handle the heavy work while humans focus on innovation and emotional intelligence. Countries worldwide are observing and adapting Japan's approach, from South Korea to the United States, integrating humanoids into healthcare, education, and service industries. In the world of education, Robots are stepping up as interactive teachers and language tutors. They help kids with everything from pronunciation to math and even teach them about empathy by encouraging polite communication. These robots don't just spit out facts, they engage students with stories, jokes, and emotional reactions. This approach builds confidence and sparks curiosity in young learners, especially those who might feel a bit shy around human teachers. In some Japanese classrooms, students are already paired with humanoid study partners that keep track of their learning progress and adapt to each child's pace, making education both enjoyable and effective. When it comes to disaster response, resilient humanoid robots are being developed to perform search and rescue missions in areas that are too dangerous for humans to enter. These machines can navigate through debris, find victims, and deliver supplies, truly saving lives in remarkable ways. Engineers have even programmed them to evaluate environmental hazards and communicate with emergency teams in real time. This level of capability demonstrates that Japan's advancements in robotics are not just about convenience. They're focused on creating technology that protects and supports human life during crises. The acceptance of humanoid robots in Japan has been gradual but steady. Initially, people approached them with a blend of curiosity and caution. However, as time has passed and with more exposure through cultural narratives, robots have become familiar companions. Japanese media often portrays robots as friendly, loyal helpers. Think of characters like Astro Boy or Doraemon, who symbolize trust rather than fear. This storytelling tradition shapes public perception, allowing people to see robots as partners in progress. One of the most exciting advancements we're seeing today is emotional AI. In Japan, engineers are creating robots that can pick up on and respond to subtle emotional signals like the tone of someone's voice, their facial expressions, or even the pauses in their speech. This technology opens the door to more meaningful and natural conversations between humans and machines. Imagine a robot that can sense sadness in your voice and respond with empathy. Maybe by suggesting a cheerful song or offering a kind word. On the physical side, humanoid robots have achieved incredible levels of realism. Some can perform yoga poses, play musical instruments, or even whip up a meal. Others are stationed in museums or airports, providing directions with impressive clarity. The lifelike quality of their movements and voices is making it harder to distinguish between humans and machines, prompting society to reconsider what we really mean by living interaction. However, Japan is committed to maintaining ethical standards that ensure these humanoids enhance, rather than replace, the emotional and social connections we have with one another. Another fascinating element is how humanoids are influencing Japan's tourism scene. Travelers from all over the globe flock to experience the country's unique robot culture. In robot cafes, humanoid waiters serve customers, 
While in theme parks, robots perform traditional dances and songs. Tourists snap photos, ask questions, and interact with these robots, captivated by how seamlessly they combine technology with personality. In education, robots are becoming interactive teachers and language tutors. They help children learn pronunciation, arithmetic, and even empathy by encouraging polite communication. They don't simply deliver information, they engage students through stories, jokes, and emotional feedback. This builds confidence and curiosity in young learners, especially those who might feel shy around human teachers. In some Japanese classrooms, students are already paired with humanoid study companions that monitor learning progress and adapt to each child's pace, ensuring personalized education that is both fun and effective. In disaster zones, robust humanoids are being developed to perform search and rescue missions where humans can't safely go. These machines climb debris, identify victims, and carry supplies, saving lives in ways never before possible. Engineers have even trained them to analyze environmental risks and communicate with emergency teams in real time. The social acceptance of humanoid robots in Japan has been gradual but steady. Initially, people approached them with curiosity mixed with caution. Over time, through consistent exposure and cultural storytelling, robots have become familiar friends. Japanese media often portrays robots as kind, loyal helpers, Think of Astro Boy or Doraemon figures who embody trust rather than fear. In the years ahead, we're going to see humanoid robots popping up more and more in our everyday lives. Yet, as they become more adept, they'll still carry the values and creativity of the people who built them. Japan's journey with humanoid robots isn't just about tech advancements. It's a story filled with empathy, determination, and a clear vision for the future. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the latest Japanese humanoid robots, leave your thoughts in the comment section, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join us for more exciting tech updates. See you in the next video.